それを探すのがあなたの役目じゃない Today, we're checking out the season two finale for Oshinoko. But first, if you enjoyed the video, click the like button, subscribe to the channel. You can find the full length as well as exclusives over on Patreon, plus other links in the description if you're interested in some non anime reactions. And maybe stop by my live streams over on Twitch so you can hang out with me and the rest of the community as we hang out and watch things like Oshinoko. Obviously, no more of this until season three comes, which I'm sure will happen. But also, I don't know. So leave a comment down below. Is there going to be a season three of Oshinoko? I, I don't know. Anyways, uh, yeah, season, season three announcement went. How'd you know? Uh, yeah, definitely stop by the live streams over on Twitch. We're watching a bunch of anime during the season. And let's watch this episode. Where is it, man? There it is. Damn it. I was too early. No. Oh, I'm going to miss this. The trauma here, bro. Uh, bro. And the craziest part, the two people she loved the most in this world were killed by the same guy. Damn. Oh my God. Bro, I stumbled. I forgot he's given up on his revenge because he thought he did, there is no revenge. Akane still got to break the news to him. Bro, this episode's monumental. This episode is going to fucking blow our minds. What? Bro, he knows that she's literally Batman. I thought you of all people could find it. There's no way. There's no way he's doing it this episode. There is absolutely no way he's dropping the bomb. No fucking way. No. No. There's no way he's dropping the bomb. It feels like he's about to right now. With the way that he's talking, it feels like he's about to drop the big bomb on her. Wait, that man was your what? Wait, 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 wait. That man was your what? Yeah, it sounds like she's implying that that man was her dad, was his dad, but that's not it. Oh no, don't say that. No. No, I don't like this. I don't like this. I might be team Kana, but I don't, I'm not team Akane sad. I don't like this at all. I'm team Akane happy. I don't like this. Change that. Yes. There we go, Aqua. Oh my god! Whoa! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait, is he saying the body was his dad? No, he was saying two separate things, but she thinks the body was his dad. She thinks that. It's tough, man. I thought he was going to drop the bomb and say that he was reincarnated. But no, right now she just thinks that the guy that was found was his dad. Oh. Oh. What the fuck is this? Oh no, nah, this shit wild, bro. This shit is crazy. Why? Bro, all right, I'm gonna be real with you, bro. I'm hey, a little kid surrounded by crows is not a little kid. That is a demon. Why the fuck are all the crows surrounding that little kid? How does anybody not see a little girl surrounded by crows and not think that she is supernatural in some capacity? This ain't conjuring, but, but it is if there's a little girl surrounded by crows. What if she's a crow breeder? Oh yeah, you're right. Yeah, she's probably a, a four-year-old crow breeder. That sounds like a great idea. That's wild. If she does not have bird feed or bread in her hands, there should not be a bunch of birds around her. She just likes her pets. Dude, what kind of demon has pet crows as a child? It's, it's creepy. 
That's all I'm really trying to say. I'm just making a joke mostly, but it's, it is creepy. I know what you want to know. Ooh. That's a very real thing though, by the way. They will literally like film summer scenes in the winter and winter scenes in the summer because of shooting schedule, right? Trying to get it out at a certain time. You got to film ahead of time. It is fucked. Ain't no way she's telling her all this stuff. And the music's come in. I wonder if he vanished because it was such an important day. That motherfucker's short as hell. Damn. Also, look at that. Chat, what did I literally say, bro? I literally said the dad is the one that put him there. Some people, some of y'all did not think that the dad sent him there literally to get shit done. A middle school aged boy. What? What? Their dad was a middle schooler when their mom was like, wait, he's 15 middle school age? Oh yeah, I guess. Yeah, probably like an eighth grader or some shit or a ninth grader, I mean. That's like a ninth grader. So now Ruby is finding out. Ruby basically just found out that the dude involved in her mom's death is the same dude involved in the guy that she loved, you know, the doctor's death. Oh, now she has set Ruby on a quest to figure it out. It's Ruby time. Come on, Ruby, you gotta, A. Hey. Turn on, turn it on and turn up. Has the prettiest face by far, damn, that's crazy. Oh. She's imitating someone. I. Come on. Come on, Ruby. Come on, Ruby. Okay. How much? That's so crazy. How much older is Aqua's uh, brother than him? Four years, right? How much older? Crazy. So he became a dad at like 11, 12 years old. And, 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 and on top of that, with I, no, no, no. I'm not talking, with I, with I, I'm assuming he's 15, 16. All right, I'm assuming he's like the same age as I. I'm talking about four years before I is when he does this shit with, with, I forgot the brother's name, bro. I'm sorry, there's too many names in this shit. That's crazy. Yeah, yeah, Himekawa. Like 11 or 12 years old, he's doing, mm, and, then, mm, and then he has a kid. That's crazy. And, and what's crazier, I don't know if we know the age of, the, of his mom. The mom's either getting rizzed up by an 11 or 12 year old or she was a similar age, which is still crazy because she's with the guy that takes on being the father of the kid. And if she's also young, I think he's similarly a, I don't know, man. That's a confusing part. I can't wait till we get to that cut part of this, uh, of this show because that is what the fuck. That is full on what the fuck. But I just, I don't know. That just hit me out of nowhere, bro. I just literally thought about it for a second. Oh, she's about to be evil in this fucking thing. Oh! Oh my god, the double dark starring gun. That must have been so weird in the fucking filming. And the, they're like filming the, the music video, and then there's that one scene of the music video that is just like depressing. There's no way that shot made it into the music video. That'd be so weird. So like different. I don't think that's what they were going for. Bro, she wants to do something special with this one. 
何か一本の線でつながっていし。Kana deserved that kiss. Kana deserved that kiss. It's crazy. She said it seems like a single thread would be able to. And it is. It's just. She's missing one thing. They say just one little. Damn. And she's gonna be in a movie? Damn. Oh. Oh, are they finally opening up to one another? No. Kana! Bro, the dark starring gun's still there. Is Ruby Peace in it together? Hey, yo, Ruby done changed, bro. Yo, hey, Ruby, hey, Ruby! That's creepy. What are we all wishing for? Aw, uh, yo, Memcho's so wholesome. We should all just switch to Team Mem. I don't care if she's actually with, with, with Aqua or anything. She's just so, so wholesome and happy. She's just adorable. Now, what's the crazy shit? Now, here come the two crazy ones. Bro, when the god was listening, the god's gonna grant the wish. Got the white glow stick, you already know. Listen, I'll be honest, I thought I bought a two pack, I only bought a one pack, uh, whatever, anyways. Ooh. Woo. All right, I'm done. Yo, they killing it with the dance. All right, now I actually want to watch the show for real, okay? Now I, I want to see the music video for real now, okay? Bro, the animators are flexing right now. I love that shit, dude. Ah, I gotta learn this dance. Bro, that's crazy. So in every scene, is she just in this dark mode? She's got the dark starring gun the entire time? Look at her. I can do that too. I can do it too. Hey, I like that song though. That song was fire. That shit's gonna be in my playlist for sure, bro. Hey, you know what? I I looked at my playlist. I gotta find this song and make sure that uh that 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 it's one that I I pop in too. My playlist. Wait. Oh, that is crazy. So he no longer nothing in there. He doesn't have that drive, but she got it now. Yo, wait, why does it look like this? Like there's like screen tearing and shit. There's more. Okay. Whoa, whoa, okay, wait, 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 wait. So, okay, first off, they inherited the dark starring gun from him. Second off. Who the fuck is that? She got the fucking ruby eyes. She got the star. That's crazy. I don't actually want to know, by the way. I'm not actually asking for who it is. I'm obviously, I don't want to know who it is. I'm just saying what's going through my mind is who is this? You know, who the fuck is that? I wish I could put this on the thumbnail, but then everyone's gonna complain about me spoiling, so I'm not gonna put it on the thumbnail. 
So I'm not going to do it, right? But it will be the thumbnail in time. I'll make it the thumbnail eventually. But that's crazy. He fucking killed her. Yeah, I don't know who that is. She, I feel like she was probably in the play. If we go back to the play, we probably run into her. But I don't, I don't remember who she is. I'll be honest with you. But okay, it was pretty insane that um, the um, the 15 year lie. I'm assuming that this is the a story that he's writing right now. The 15 year lie. But this is the fact that he no longer has the eyes, and now she does. Now she's the one that wants the revenge. He don't even know. He thinks all is fucking fun and games in the world. That is fucking crazy, bro. That is a fucking wild ending, bro. Oh my god. What a good one. That was insane. That was pretty damn insane. Um Akane in costume? No. Nah. Wouldn't be different eyes. Different eyes. Different eyes. Who's writing? I would assume that it is Aqua, but maybe not. I don't know. Good question. I'm still on the fence with the exchange between him and Akane. I feel like, yeah, I don't know, man. I'm kind of on the fence about it too. I don't know if he is actually doing this because he loves Akane or if, if I don't know if he kissed Akane because he loves Akane or like more so because he appreciates her. Maybe he feels some type of way about having her like go out and do things for him, like using her. But maybe it is love. I don't know. It's just as a as a Kana fan, it's hard for me to say that. Now I will say Akana, Akana, eh. Akane, Akane won this episode. That's fair. I didn't like that half a year has passed and Akane didn't tell him yet about his father, because she thinks it's the one from the cave. Correct. Yeah, the way that that whole conversation goes down, he is like he literally says like you know about my dad, the guy in the cave. But like it almost sounds like about my dad, the guy in the cave. You know what I mean? I think it's just a it's just another misinterpretation, uh, misunderstanding, not misinterpretation, but misunderstanding. It's been so many. She literally thinks that. Yeah, I think you're right. She thinks that that he has basically said that his dad was the guy in the cave, and that's how she kind of like, oh, he knows this guy, right? Ruby also knew the guy. He's got stories of the guy right why were they born in this town the grandparents are from this town like it all kind of lines up like if you don't like question it if you don't say like hey was this guy your dad you could kind of see how this guy might be the dad like she knows that the other guy was not the dad and now she finds out that this guy is the dad except it's not it, it's just a bunch of misunderstandings season three should be fire i'm excited for that uh good ass episode man love me some some insanity here. Uh, the fact that Ruby is now the one is pretty wild. And that fucking crow god literally talks to her and like, hey, you gotta find the answers for yourself. But she does make the wish. She makes the wish, basically saying that she wants Aqua to figure out who the fuck the killer is. And then quickly after, jumps over to the, the god, the little girl's expression, right? Like, oh, you made a wish? I'll make it come true. I'm excited, dude. I'm very much excited. Um, eventually, Akane has got to say something. But damn, good ass episode. Anyways, this was a good ass episode. What'd you guys think? Let me know down in the comments. And if you enjoyed the video, don't just leave a comment. Also, like and subscribe. Until next time, make sure you all keep it fresh. Peace.